Got a Civic in the shop that needs a new sun visor clip. Let's see if we can't get it fixed. This is what we're working on today, a 2000 Honda Civic. All right, let's take a look at the one that's broken. We can see it's sheared off right there. If we look at the other side, that's what it should look like. So we got to get this one off and get the new one installed. Here's the part number for the new part. Always double check for your application. Typically there'll be different part numbers for different colors and of course different years and models and things like that. So that's what this one looks like and that's right there is about where the, other, the old one sheared off. Here's our new one. Of course it sits in the vehicle like this. So there's an opening in the back and so all we have to do is just press that in a little bit enough to get it to turn because this is kind of locking it in place so if we just press this tab in a little bit and hold it in then we just have to turn it and once we get it moving then it's okay and we just need to turn it to about a 90 degree and then pop it out now once they get old in the desert they just snap off right here as soon as you press this in you just press a little bit bang it snaps off so you got to be careful of that once these uh you know things get old even if you don't live in the desert they can probably get brittle and just snap off right there so if you're trying to reuse it you may not be able to if it's uh if it's original to the car and the car is old in this case i don't care i'm just going to reach in there i'm going to snap it off and then turn it you can turn it either way we just need to turn it and then just kind of wiggle it out sometimes they can be jammed in there if they haven't been removed for in a while hopefully you can see this is not a great angle but we're just gonna kind of I don't care, I'm just trying to break this tab off. Yeah, looking at our old one, you can see that's how they snap off. Hopefully you can see it. Yeah, it's just held on like right at the top. Just right up there is all that's holding it on. So that's why they're pretty easy to snap off. And then once you get it out of the way, then we can just turn it, pull it out. With the old one out, we can see that there's a keyway up at the top here and down here. And that coincides with this little notch right here, and then there's another notch right there. So that's what we got to get into place in order to get it out and to put the new one back in. We just line it up with our notches just like that, and then we turn it, and then until it snaps into place, that little locking tab will lock into that back notch, and then we're good to go. And you have to look really close, but you might notice the new one's gray. The old one was like a tan, or very light tan. They're very close in color, but I couldn't get the tan one anymore. So it was either have a gray one and have it fixed, or have a tan that's broken. So I went with the gray that fixes it. All right, let's test it out. Hey, look at that. Works good. Well, that's it for this one. And as always, if the video helped you out, you liked it, make sure to give it a thumbs up. Thanks for watching.